one of the ways that we show up for the community is trying to find those stories that uh, need to be told. You know, storytelling is a very powerful medium and what we've been able to do in this space and the people that we've been able to help and the awareness that we've been able to create is something that I think is just one avenue of how we support and show up for the community. Hutsi is a lot of things, but we are a collective of storytellers that started out in 2017 to change the way that creatives thought about the region. Instead of being competition, uh, we wanted to make it more about collaboration and bring everybody's attention to one place to be able to see all the beautiful things that are happening here in the Hudson Valley. Being a filmmaker, creator, one of the things that I felt was lacking was a disconnect. A disconnect within the storytellers and the filmmakers in the community and also the stories that are being told and the community at large. And we, what we wanted to do was try to find a way to connect both ends of that. We have three initiatives. We have our Create, Educate, and Connect initiatives. And Create, we make Hutsi original films. And we also highlight festivals and cultural events that are happening around the region because we have such a diverse and beautiful amount of cultures here. Our Educate initiative, we teach the next generation of storytellers how to do that, how to bring people together. And through our Connect initiative, we show all of this in one place on hutsy.tv, where we have over 600 films that all have a connection to the Hudson Valley. And we also bring people together at our mashup events and our beyond the screen events. We help the community by breaking down barriers, by telling stories that aren't often told, that fall through the cracks, that help people to understand each other better. Filming with Hutsi, um, I think I have a deeper understanding of, uh, of the importance to get a message out to a broader audience to reach more hearts. Hutsi's been in full support of creating a model for uh, indigenous peoples to have a safe place to be ourselves. Honestly, the biggest thing for us is we try to also show the struggle. Because a lot of these organizations, a lot of these folks, you know, you see them for who they are and how they show up, but you don't recognize or see the struggles that they go through to get their organizations to where they want to, want to get, get them to. Struggles in the day to day, just uh, assimilating to another culture, assimilating to a, another uh, vibration, frequency, pace. Uh, we overcome it by um, coming together and celebrating ourselves and you know, sharing that message of love and light with all peoples. It feels comforting that movements like Munaiwasi can meet other ones like Hutsi and share um, similar visions of what uh, a bright future could look like. The future of Hutsi is to create as much opportunity as we can here in not only the Hudson Valley, but the film industry so that people can not only make a living off of this, but they can also do what they love to do. When I got the call, it was Jess Davis. I fumbled on words because I just, I just didn't really know how to process that we won the award, because um, it's super humbling. I felt really honored. I feel like a lot of being in the creative space, you have imposter syndrome and aren't really sure what you're doing all the time. And I feel like I personally believe we set impact, we do great things for the community, but to see that others are also believing as much as I am and our team is, felt really beautiful.